season. Syracuse looking for a resurgence as well. Dino Babers going into his second season there in upstate New York and he's going to do it with the help of top 10 quarterback Tommy DeVito visited Syracuse back in April for his uh, visit there in upstate New York shortly after that said you know what I'm going to be a part of this now you're part of this show. Uh, he's not. He's, he's Tommy DeVito. He's, he's his own man. What kind, what kind of fit are you there at, at Syracuse? Um, myself, I believe that I'll be able to help the team win more games and uh, be the leader that I need to be at the quarterback position. Tommy DeVito, the uh, quarterback of the future. Tommy DeVito, quarterback from Cedar Grove, New Jersey, transfer from Syracuse University. I'm not the dude that's very quiet in the locker room. Football is all about energy to me. I'm from Cedar Grove, New Jersey. North Jersey, not South Jersey or Central Jersey, just North Jersey. Illinois fans can expect a vocal leader who's a competitor and is going to win football games. Family to me is everything. It's about trust and love, whether that's being at home with my family in New Jersey or on the football field with my new family in Illinois. You got to be able to trust one another and love one another and play for each other. I want my teammates to know I'm going to battle for them every single snap, every single day. My favorite route to throw is a deep ball for a touchdown. I'll see you on the end zone. Brian Dable to try to take advantage of the field position and turn it into four downs. Back to throw, pressure, in trouble, takes off, DeVito, head down inside the five. They go with Brita in the backfield here, Blitz is coming, DeVito in trouble and he is sacked. Neville Gallimore gets home. Third down, Blitz coming, pressure, DeVito in trouble, slips away from Curse. now tucks it and runs. And he's going to see what Tommy DeVito is able to do here down four scores, guys. Yeah, hopefully stay on the field a little bit. Pressure coming, and he's sacked on the first play. Dante Fowler gets home, third sack of the day for the Cowboys. The back, second Tommy DeVito hit his back foot. Fowler was there. Here's DeVito looking for a little something, and he's going to get dropped again to Marcus Lawrence. Back-to-back -back sacks to start this third quarter. And there's a lot that's going wrong. DeVito going deep. He's got a man high. It is open. But then the seam closes and it's intercepted. Guess who? Deron Bland again. He's got his fifth of the year. It's tough. Um, you put a lot into the week, a lot into the preparation, practices, meetings, time with your teammates. And obviously it's not the outcome we want. But, um, you know, something's got to change. We just got to be better. I won't feel sorry for myself. I mean... You get put in any situation, your job is to get out of it. Um, we just got to get more first downs. All due respect, you got no fucking idea what it's like to be number one. Every decision you make affects every facet of every other fucking thing. It's too much to deal with almost. And in the end, you're completely alone with it all. <laughs> Pack it up, pack it in. As simple as, or even easier than, playing a record. Pack it up, pack it in. Ready on the right, ready on the left. Ready on the right, ready on the left. But if you do, you're a fool, cause I'm doomed to the, to the Trying to step to me, you take it, take it
it, take it, I got the skill, come get your bill. This one, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. It's fun. I tell you, like, when, when things are going right and you feel like you're going right, it's a lot of fun. It feels like you're just enjoying it and playing the game of football like you were when you were a kid. Former Giant, New Giants quarterback. Giants first win at home over the Patriots. Well, I don't know exactly what Jersey Juice is. Well, I don't know exactly what Jersey Juice is. Well, I don't know exactly what Jersey Juice is, but I think that everyone is going to be drinking it after this win today. Take a look around, right? You grew up 12 miles from here, the pride of New Jersey. Your family and friends are here. What's this moment been like for you, Tommy? That's amazing. I mean, just have the team come together at the end of the day, get a win. It wasn't the prettiest, but that's all that matters is that W in the win column. I think it's just never quitting, believing in our, each other, believing in our coaches. The way that we practice, the way that we do, go about our meetings, it's, they're the best. Everybody on this team is the best. Can we get like the celebration maybe? Yeah, we can get a celebration. Cool, <laughs> calm, and collected so I go in the locker room with my guys, and then, then we'll be, everybody's going to be doing this, and then we're good. Enjoy, Tommy. <laughs> game go execute a drive that we practice every day before practice which is a two-minute drive we do it every day different situations um, I assume over all the practices we've had that exact situation or something very similar to it so just go out execute the offense and go win a game how much do you like being in that situation 
I mean, you enjoy it when it's an outcome like this, right? Um, I mean, I enjoy being on the field any play, no matter what play it is, so I'm just trying to enjoy it. Is he representing Italians? Is he representing New Jersey? Well, let me <laughs> see. He may be a little bit with the TD chain and the uh, and this, but hey, it's New Jersey and... I expected just to have fun for myself. Like, personal goal, just myself, just to play football. You know, you never know what game's going to be your last. Obviously, I've had, I've had injuries in the past, and, you know, you don't want to take anything for granted. So if we just do that and just try to help the team just win as many games as possible, obviously that's everyone's goal, but as a quarterback, you know, that's the only thing that really matters.